Geek Treasure Fan Joe Pal Big D back here again with a new weekly news announcement, and this is for February 2nd, 2021. Those of you new to my channel, I do this every week where I talk about what's coming out of new on Blu-ray, DVD, and 4K. Uh, this week and next week, and I discuss any majorly announced after that. Um, yeah, so let's just get started. I'm gonna make this real quick today. There's not a whole lot. It seems like things will slow down a little bit, um, release-wise, but they'll, they should pick up again soon. Although there's been a couple big, really uh, big titles announced, so that's good news. So today, which is actually I'm filming on the on the day, we do have. Um, let's see here. First movie coming out uh, this week is, and I already got it. Small Soldiers. This comes out this week. Um, this is a great movie. If you've never seen this movie, is is like Gremlins meets the, uh, like. Uh, Puppet Master, maybe or something like that. It's a really good film. It's it's kind of fa it's family friendly and it's it's a lot of fun. I love this movie. So this comes up today, Small Soldiers, and the other one that comes today that I managed to pick up was Ladybugs. Yes, Ladybugs. Paramount title. Paramount's putting them out now, so I'm pretty stoked. There's no special features, but it is Ladybugs. My favorite comedian of all time is Mr. Roger Dangerfield, and I'm um, just stoked and glad to have this. You know, it's really sad too because. Brandon, um, what was his name? Um, Jonathan Brandis was really good, really good upcoming actor. He he died. He committed. I believe he committed suicide not too long after they did this. Really sad. Great actor too. He had a. He was gonna. He would have been big. Um, but it's great to have this finally. Um, so I got that. Also, that comes out today. We have Mouse Hunt, and uh, let's see here. Um, Let him go. I, I that's a. Uh, I've heard some things about that now. And it's got uh, Kevin Costner. It's supposed to be pretty good. Then we do have Scorpion releasing. Uh, Scorpion is releasing The Norseman. Um, Shout Factory is releasing a movie called Tesla, which is, I guess, about Nikola Tesla. And then the last thing coming out today is Do the Right Thing in 4K for the first time. I do believe there's a 4K steelbook at Target. Don't hold me to that, but I kind of heard or I heard rumors about that. But it does come out today in 4K for the first time, so that's really good. Now, next week, we do have a couple of titles coming out. Um, first off, Elysium is coming out for the first time in 4K. Does that complete the Blown Camp um, series now? I know Chabby's available in 4K. Um, District 9 is available in 4K. So, yeah, Elysium, that's it. I think that's all of them now. Um, also, um, Freaky comes out tomorrow, um, which I really like that movie. That, that was really good. I was I was really, I was really kind of taken aback. I didn't think I was going to like it very much because it's very much like that. It's very much the um, uh, the Freaky Friday situation. Only you know this this crook switches bodies with a, a teenage girl, but it's absolutely hilarious. Um, y y it was funny. You got to watch it. Um, also, next week uh, Paramount presents is releasing Elizabeth Town for the first time on Blu-ray. Um, let's see here. Shout Factory is releasing My Bloody Valentine Steelbook. So they released My Bloody Valentine. I want to say it's about this time last year it came out. And now they're releasing a steelbook for the same movie. There's nothing different. It's just, it's just a steelbook now. Shout Factory has a tendency to do that. If you're a fan of Shout Factory like I am, they have a tendency to do this where they'll put the movies out. And then like a year or so later, all of a sudden, steelbook comes up for the same movie. So like Prince of Darkness was another one, uh, was one of those. They live, you know, they they have a tendency to do this where like a year later, oh, we're putting a steelbook out now. It's like, come on, man. Like, was it Forbidden World Link it was? There was something else. It was like, ah, man. So they have a tendency to do this. So if you've been holding out, the steelbook will be out, um, next week um full moon is releasing a, a, i believe it's unedited version an edit, unedited version of tourist trap um i have their version already um so we'll see i, I know that the, the version they were selling beforehand had cut out a couple key scenes and i believe this restores those so there's that and then the last movie coming out next week is uh greenland which was actually a really good movie i really enjoyed that we we saw it not too long ago on demand, and I actually really enjoyed it. I, I thought it was a really good movie. Really, I, I thought it was a lot of fun. I mean, yeah, there's some issues with it. Hey, my cat over there trying to tear apart the window. Um, so there was a few issues with pacing and stuff like that, but I still really enjoyed it. I, you know, it was it was a fun movie, and uh, I, I would definitely recommend uh, taking a look at it when it does come out. All right, with that being said, let's talk about what was announced. There were some big titles, a lot of animated titles uh, coming out, so... The first one is they did announce the Croods 2 A New Age coming out on the 23rd of this actual month. So like three weeks from now. Um, and it'll be available on Blu-ray, DVD, and 4K. Um, we also have Monster Hunter, which was announced, which, which will be out a month from today, March 3rd. I mean, March 2nd. Um, and that's the Mila Jovovich movie. Uh, looks pretty cool. I don't know. I really want to see it. 
And then uh, Paramount Presents is releasing uh, Paramount. So it's part of their Paramount Presents line is releasing The Greatest Show on Earth. Uh, that'll be at the 30th of March. Another really good classic movie. It's really good to see Paramount really grabbing hold with these movies and bringing back, you know, bringing some of these movies back to life. Like Golden Child was recently pretty in pink. Movies have never been available for them. They're kind of just sitting on a shelf. Paramount's gone back now and, and doing a really nice job with them. It's really cool. They have a fold-out poster art of the original poster. And they're really cool stuff. Um, and then the last movie that I saw is announced, this is a big one too, which was Disney Soul. That will be out on the 23rd of March, so not that far away. Um, Blu-ray, DVD, and 4K, I would imagine Best Buy will have a 4K steelbook for this one. Um, Soul was a really good movie. It wasn't as good as, um, oh, I still, still my favorite one is, uh, what is it? Uh, Wally is one of my favorite ones, but I, I actually really like Soul. I, I it, out of the two movies they released, like the other one was uh, Chris. Oh shoot, oh, I can't remember it though. That one was the one was. Early, I'm sorry. Leave me a comment down below what the earlier one was this year. It was the one with Chris Pratt, the aliens. Their dad had, had died, and they were you know that movie really got to me because of, because of personal experiences. So I thought that was better last year than Soul, but Soul was still a really good movie. I thought it was really well animated. The music was ah beautiful. Um, and I, I really did enjoy it. So that comes out the 23rd of next month. So again, not very far away. So that's great. And that is it. There's not a, nothing else really majorly announced. I'm not hearing any rumors right now. So I'm going to go with that. But that is it for now. Um, be on the lookout. There's a few sales going on right now. I know that um, Kino Lober just added more to their going out of print uh, stuff. Uh, you might want to take a look at those go pretty quickly. Once they're gone, they're gone. Um, so I want to take a look at that and, uh, I don't know the other sales going on right now. So nothing major anyway. So that is it for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave me some comments, com com <laughs> man, please leave me some comments down below. Um, click, uh, subscribe the bell. Um, you know, that whole, the whole thing there. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I am got a couple more subscribers. Welcome aboard. Uh, I am really close to the 500, so I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do for the 500 uh, subscriptions. But um, thank you again so much. Please be careful out there and take care. Always keep hunting as because you never know what you're going to find. Those of you on the East Coast, please be safe. That winter storm coming through right now, that is nasty. Us on the West Coast, we're just getting rain here. So again, thank you so much. Please be careful. Always keep hunting because you never know what you're going to find. And as always, live long and prosper. Bye.